No controversy in Saginaw over its pandemic aid. Council members getting an update on the $52 million that Saginaw got from the federal government. Among the projects in progress, $8 million for City Hall's HVAC system, $5.9 million for Ojibwe Island improvements, $3.8 million for the home repair program, and $2.5 million for a behavioral clinic. $4 million for housing, $2 million for food insecurity have yet to be allocated. City still has $1.1 million in unobligated funds. City Council members also got an update on the push to renovate the iconic Second National Bank building at Washington and East Genesee. Developers are now asking for some rescue plan money to help that project go from the planning stages to reality. They say that the $50 million project depends on public-private partnerships. While the project will cost $50 million, it will only appraise for $20 million, leaving a significant gap in financing. Uh, Michigan Community Capital has already raised tens of millions of dollars to close the gap, uh, which has come from state, federal, and private sources. And we have spent more than $500,000 uh, of our own money to start designs and to conduct pre-development due diligence. Michigan Community Capital says that the project will bring 119 workforce apartments to the area.